the poor marketing strategies and attractive courses, poor infrastructure have been pointed on as the bottlenecks still barring the attraction of international students to public universities. Katunguka says to increase the enrollment of international students in public universities, courses at both undergraduate and postgraduate must be tailored in a way attractive and unique. One is have attractive programs. Programs both at undergraduate level and postgraduate level, we call them graduate programs, masters, PhDs, attractive and unique programs which other people in other countries would want to have. But if a university wants to be known outside, then it must invest in its publicity activities. The underfunding of public universities and inadequate human resources are being pinpointed as those hindering attraction of international students into these public universities. Language barrier has also been highlighted as one limiting integration of these students. Funding of public universities is a dismal. Univers these universities are struggling. The, the infrastructure is not good, it's limited. The staffing levels are limited and you cannot attract international students if you cannot show that you will teach them and that's a big negative aspect of our institutions. Uh, we have courses now at the university, we have uh, the language courses, we have uh, French courses, Chinese has started, uh, Swahili courses and maybe as we get into higher levels of internationalization other languages will be introduced in the university. On the side of Uganda students gaining scholarships admission to foreign universities, public universities are to leverage on the collaboration initiated through academic exchange programs. Um, so for Ugandan students or faculty that are interested in study in the United States, I encourage you to look at a website called Education USA, which gives free resources on how to apply to U.S. universities and find the right program for you. The government universities, there are no uh, fees, tuition fees, so um, education is free. Um, yeah, and it so it makes each student to have the possibility to, to um, study the course he or she would want to study through hard work. When you hear maybe someone speaking a different language and you don't understand, um, you are they are like prompted to learn the English language, most especially because we all speak English. Crispus, Arinitwe, Abdullah Silwama, UBC News.